If you're new here, I'm a artist and potter from Melbourne and yeah, in this video I do a lot of making pottery for my new collection which is coming soon. So I've been working on that and I also had my pottery painting picnic which was really fun. It was like I hosted an event where people could come and paint some trinket dishes I made and they're currently getting fired but yeah those were sort of the things i've been doing i'll also be glazing them painting them in the next videos and you can see how they turn out so yeah i hope you stick around for that and hope you enjoy this video see you in a bit to you guys in a while um because i've just been filming what i've been doing but i wanted to give an update um so yeah i started making these little dog jars i just need to make the lid for this one today um and then i made little sculptures um, I was feeling kind of tired yesterday, so I was like, just do something small. And this is a frog. And it has a butt. I'm very proud of it. And I think these are really cute. I like them. But I was just cleaning them up, smoothing them out. But yeah, today I would like to work on the jars i think i want to do another jar with a frog on top and then also i need to do i'm making these like mirrors where it's like a polaroid picture but the picture part is going to be a mirror and so i'm just going to make the frame of it and add some cute decoration to that so that's my plan and yeah, just a lot of pottery making days. I'm gonna have a few pieces in store in a shop in Melbourne and then the rest of it would just be a normal online shop. So that's what I've been working on 
yeah I don't know if this will get repetitive so I might not film every day I'm making pottery but yeah I'm excited for this new stuff because I'm doing a lot of new designs I don't really tend to like repeating old designs just because I like to move on from them so if you ever want something you should get it when it comes out because I can't guarantee that I'll make it again but yeah I'm gonna keep working on pottery today what I did. I'm very happy with it. I really like this fluoro pink pen and yeah I quite like working with the pen. I feel like you can be very sketchy with it but not too like perfect because you're not using pencil. You have to commit with the pen and yeah I really enjoyed doing this. I should definitely do it more and yeah Here's how it turned out and I think I'm going to maybe walk around a bit but head home. Hi, 
It is pottery in the park day and I've just gotten ready and prepped everything, put everything in the trolley. I just have to put in some food. I'm baking some cinnamon scrolls and I wanted them to be fresh so I still have that to do and then yeah just adding the cold drinks and stuff last minute but I think I'm pretty much ready and I'm excited. I'm a bit nervous because it's like the first event I've hosted by myself. Um, you know, I haven't done it before so it is a bit scary but I think it'll be good and hopefully everyone will enjoy painting some pottery. So yeah, let's go. At this stop, the doors will open on the left hand side of the tram. Yeah, I couldn't fall asleep again Been overthinking all the little things I've said I'm sleep deprived almost every night And I wish that I wouldn't think instead I know the sun is up and I got things to do But I don't think I've got the energy to move And I go back to my dreams again But I shouldn't be sleeping when It's daylight now and I'm stuck in my bed Hi, the pottery picnic went really well and yeah I had a lot of fun, it went better than I expected I think. Everyone was sort of talking and I felt like I made friends with everyone which was really nice. I feel like it was all sort of like-minded people, all kind of interested in art. So it was really nice to connect with everyone and see what everyone made. Like I, I'm really excited to see how they turn out after firing. But yeah, since I kind of planned to only do one to test it out, I didn't know that it would kind of be quite popular and people were asking for like the next one. Yeah, and it takes a lot of time to like pre-make all the pieces, plan it out. So I don't think I'll be able to do another one before I go away in March, but maybe after. And I'm also wanting to do some like indoor workshops for when I can't do a picnic. So I'd be really keen to do that because I enjoyed this so much and like sort of sharing art in person is always my favorite. And that's the end of this video. I hope you have a lovely day and I'll see you in the next one. Bye.